4 o'clock. <laughs> I didn't vlog in the morning because I woke up. I mean, not late, but like late for me. And so I like rushed out the door and then I got to work. I was doing something else and then I didn't get time to start the vlog so then I said well I'm not gonna start at lunchtime so I was like we'll just we'll just start it halfway through the day because we're gonna do some fun things kind of I guess tonight so it'll just be a tonight vlog instead of like a today vlog you know what I mean but anyway so I am home now from work it was a good day um both of my children were great so that was exciting <laughs> Good times. Um, but today was holiday sweater. That's why I was like, they didn't call it ugly sweater. Holiday sweater or shirt day. So I wore my 2018, can't really see this and I can't really jump up, um, Christmas jersey from Disney. Words are real hard right now, clearly. Um, so that was my shirt of choice for today. And then we also had... An employee appreciation lunch so they made me food and it was great and good times and then our teacher brought in cookies so we ate cookies and um, good times but on the way out they gave us a little goodie bag so I figured we could unbox it together see what it is first we have tissue paper and then we have a bag of hot chocolate, delicious, as much calcium as an 8 ounce glass of milk. Intriguing. And we also have a, oh my god, this is adorable, tis the season, so cute, coffee cup. Whoa. That's, I mean, it's just black inside. It looks like it's double layered. Like, it definitely looks like that. But anyway, this is adorable and love this. And we also have some candy canes. And I, I knew we were going to get something from Girl Scouts because of our admin. Um, so we got dark chocolate mint penguins, which I'm probably going to bring this home. Because I'm sure, because it's mint, my mom will probably eat these. And I don't really like mint, so I would eat the dark chocolate part. But I don't know how much I will want mint. We'll see what they taste like. But I will bring these home. And these can be enjoyed by multiple people. And then the last thing in here is a sugar scrub. And this is what it looks like. And then let's just open it up. Interesting. <laughs> I don't know. I like my brain was like, oh, here, smell this. But then my hand was like, oh, let me show them what it looks like. But my brain thought I was showing you for you to sniff it. Yeah, we're a little delusional. Um, but that's what it looks like. And it has white sugar, brown sugar, extra virgin olive oil, vanilla, aioli, and essential oils of lavender and geranium geranium I don't know but it smells nice usually I use sugar scrubs on my lips I'm just gonna sugar scrub it up um I don't really know what the sugar scrub is for Besides, if they just gave us a giant bottle of sugar scrub for our lips. Because, I mean, I'm down. And it works. It's going to take off all that dry skin, you know? So, perfect. I'm going to look a real good. Beautiful. <laughs> that was adorable. And since we're all already sitting here, I figured, after I clean off all this sugar, I should probably vacuum before I leave. But that's just a side note. Um, I figured we could also open up my advent calendar. Long story short, it was the wrong guy. I've been listening to Taylor Swift's new album. 
every day in the morning mostly because when it's already on a certain album or playlist or whatever my phone will just keep playing that and I haven't made any effort to like change it so it's like not intentional but also I haven't made an effort to change it so <laughs> here we are all right next up we have another pin <gasps> so cute caro deja vu it's egyptian goofy i'm dying oh my god it's another adventures by disney <gasps> that's so cool see you guys I really want to do Adventures by Disney because it's the best of both worlds. I get to travel to a new country or location or have a new adventure but still be sponsored by Disney so then it's still kind of like a Disney vacation but I also get to check like things off my bucket list. Ugh. I just I need the world to get back to normal so I can do something next year and for years to come because I have a goal of every year doing something new on my bucket list so mostly pertaining to like travel to a new city or country or state however it may be which what with what fits into my life at the time so I'm gonna need 2021 to get their life together so I can plan something and check things off my bucket list but besides that love this pin for the day this is so cute I'm gonna show it off one more time hopefully you can see that in the lights nice but he's so adorable Ugh, i don't know how you can just love goofy oh love him all right so now that it is 4 24 i'm thinking we can watch some youtube and then i think i'm gonna tackle the packing that's sitting next to me and we can just figure out what we're gonna pack together for california i mean you know yesterday i like laid it out somewhat but I'll think more logically and really put it all together tonight that's what I'm thinking I think that'll be somewhat exciting also could do some more fun games as a potential I don't know we'll see I would say let me know but um that's not real possible right now anyway I'll catch you guys in a hot minute Hi friends, so we are in my bathroom and no, this is not my lighting. I brought my ring light in here because my bathroom lighting absolutely stinks. However, um, I have been watching a lot of YouTube and people have been changing up their hair and the last time I changed my hair was May or something and I did myself because of quarantine and it was like fine. <laughs> So I figured um, we're going to attempt that again and we're going to spice up this vlog and we're going to have a hair transformation, possibly. So, I got my trash can. I got to go grab my scissors. I don't have that. And we're going to cut my hair. Might be exciting. Might be a fail. Might look cute. I don't know. But might as well. Right? I mean, like, the worst that could happen is it grows back. So, <laughs> it ain't that big of a deal. It's just hair. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is just grab all my hair. And then twist it. Bring it forward and twist it. I'm going to let that loosen a little bit. And then we're going to cut our first little bit. Can you see my cutting? No. Let me bring this over here. All right. Flip that over. Perfect. And now we're just going to keep going with that until I get something that I want.
any shorter. I can't tell. I feel like it's not much shorter yet. However, I do have some layers I can see. I know the worst idea to do is just like cut straight across, but like my natural instinct is just go one, two, and then be done. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna do it a couple more times. How's this look from the back? Can you tell? I can't tell guys because I can't see. But I feel like I mean that's probably decent. There's definitely a lot more layers. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. See I feel like I want it at this layer but like do I trust myself to do that I don't really think so so the most basic of it sounds like a better idea <sighs> I feel like this is still the same length this is such a process okay I'll be back in a few seconds <laughs> okay so I'm back I don't know how different this looks but I think this is where I'm gonna stop so that it doesn't get too crazy I do know to not um, assume that I can do it but after I, you saw me do the twist and tops which creates layers and cuts at the same time I decided I did have enough layers uh, and I didn't want to keep messing with that because then that can get real nasty looking. Um, but what I did do is split my hair again and then I just chop from like the end the longest layers and then I went to the mirror in my bedroom to make sure that it all looked even. I think it does. I don't think it looks too bad. I mean, it obviously could look better from a professional, but also it's all right, you know? So hopefully this is a little bit shorter than what I just had it at. I mean, there's, there's hair in the trash can. So like stuff came off my head. I just have no idea how much actually. So I think we should like pop up a before and after. So then we can see what the length really came off of was. It could be nothing. This could be just over dramatic. I don't really know. However, I decided that since we're halfway there with this like new hair look, I might as well take the last of what was in my cabinet and um, we're going to dye it. <laughs> so come along and dye my hair with me, which... I have not done by myself mm, ever maybe once in seventh grade so this is gonna be real interesting um, luckily the color is dark brown so it can't do much damage to what my hair actually is so if like I miss spots or if it goes wrong it it can't be that bad because it's legit just matching the hair that I have um, except covering up some of the lighter pieces so yeah, anyway, we're going to mix up some Ion Intensive Shine Permanent Hair Color uh, Darkest Intense Brown, 2NN is the number, there it is, hopefully that was in focus, and then I'm going to mix up the rest of my 10 developer with my hair naturally being dark, and when I first dyed it, it was at its like natural 
pretty much. Um, I you just use half a bottle, so I'm gonna do the same thing. And I'm just going to use the one that I have left, which hopefully with shorter hair, there's even less. Like, this is going to be enough. We'll see. Hopefully, I don't run out. I will have to try to be cautious of how much glob I'm putting on my head. But that is why I changed into a new shirt from earlier today. So I don't get that one all messed up. Because that would stink. Also, I left my gloves over there. I have to go get those. But... Yeah, I think that's it. And let's get started. Okay, so I grabbed my gloves. And I don't really know what I'm doing. My friends usually do this for me. And then they put it on my head for me. So, yeah. <laughs> this is not my expertise in the mixing department. I'm good at dyeing my friend's hair once they mixed it. <laughs> So, there's that. Alright. I hate pushing these tubes down. I just feel like it's so hard to get anything out. Ugh. Come on. Okay, it's going to take me a minute. Give me a second. Okay, so I have finally squirted out as much as I could out of that container um, that was the worst squeeze container experience of my life um, don't know what happened and why that was so rough but it was um, now I have to figure out how to oh <laughs> perfect got my developer now let me put my glove back on excuse me Oh my gosh, I can't do anything. <sighs> okay. And then we're just going to pour this in here. <laughs> that came out heck of fast. And then we're going to mix this up and hope for the best. And get all the ones that are, everything that's on the side. Again, I am no professional. I do not know what I'm doing. As I get some on the carpet. Oh, oh well. I don't know, like, because the box said it's good for 24 months, and this is definitely a year old. So, like, I don't think this is expired, but also... This looks weird. <laughs> it's just so lumpy. And maybe that's why it was so awkward coming out of the container and why... Oh my god, I'm making such a mess. This does not look right. <laughs> I should probably not put this on my head. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I really hope I didn't just dump that. I mean, it's turning a little brown. It's just, it's really still clumpy. But. Oh, well, let's try it. Okay, this is going to stink because my mirror is so freaking tall oh my gosh I do not have the correct body length for this I don't think this is right I don't think this is going to do anything it was like way too big of a piece at one time I can't see what I'm doing. Alright, forget it. <laughs> I'm going to do all the things that will make a hairdresser cringe. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Okay, so here's the aftermath. I am covered in dye all over and I don't know if this is dye or because the blue glove or whatnot, but it is all over my body. Um, so I'm gonna try to take that off a little bit, but let me show you the non-body destruction of what just happened. Okay, so here is the sink that now is blue from brown hair dye and my rug that's kind of new is now blue from brown hair dye and then I got a little on the side there and there's some there I think there's like a spot on my phone but um yeah it's a little bit of a war zone up in here my my feet died died uh, this is this is a rough oh there we go this is a rough one um i have to say this is a whole lot easier when someone else is there to help you but my hair looks darker and i know it's getting darker so this might not be a fail we'll have to see I'm gonna give it like 30 minutes and then we're gonna shower and we're gonna see <laughs> oh geez as long as my camera and ring light are okay that's all that matters let's be honest okay well we've been sitting 30 minutes here is the look uh, my face I pretty much got clean so that's exciting. I got most of what's off my arm, or I at least got it like darker, so that's good. But now I am going to hop in the shower and wash this out, and then we'll see the final result. All right, guys, here is the final product with the with the lamp and frame. But this is how it turned out. What do you guys think? I know it's really hard to kind of tell. Oh, maybe that'll do it. Um, I feel like it's very, like, blue-black, which would make sense for how it <laughs> dyed all the furniture. But, I mean, it worked. It did, it did what it was supposed to do. It dyed my hair, and it doesn't look like I can't go out in public anymore. So, a solid win! I mean... We got, we got the hair trimmed a little bit. I feel like it is shorter now that I'm like really looking at it. I'm sorry I'm not even looking at the lens to you guys. I just keep looking at the, the camera because I just keep staring at myself. But anyway, here is the back. Oh, hold on. There we go. You can't really see it, but there's the back. Awesome. All right, guys, thank you so much for following along on my journey of um, dyeing my hair and cutting my hair all by myself for the second time. <laughs> and now we are a brand new person for 2021, pretty much. <laughs> Although I'll probably get this cut again. Who knows? We'll see. I can't wait till my bangs grow out a little more, so then they're like the length of the the shortest part of like the longer piece of hair because I definitely wish I did not do bangs because my face cannot handle them I just get headaches but anyway thank you guys so much for watching I hope you have enjoyed vlogmas day 16 we are so close to Christmas it is crazy we are almost done with vlogmas which is insane and I've done very well with vlogmas we are keeping it up Thank the Lord. <laughs> I can say I did it pretty soon. Pretty soon. Not yet, but pretty soon. <sighs> All right, guys. Well, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 17. And it's happy Thursday, which means it's almost Friday, which means it's almost Saturday. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. -ray. All right, guys. Bye.